guys today we are unboxing this H410MH uh, from Gigabyte it is motherboard for LGA1200 the new Intel processor family this is one of the cheapest if not the cheapest motherboard for LGA1200 let's see what's inside the motherboard backplate, EO shield or whatever and two safety cables and some leaflets installation CD mostly useless now and that's in the package let's see the board itself of course you can't expect more as it is so cheap this board should be around 60-65 bucks or something as you can see it is very small it is probably the so-called flex ATX form factor it is as wide as traditional micro ITX boards but it is a little bit longer because it has some more ports there and it's possible that you can put it inside some of the larger ITX cases which have three slots there are some of them we have M.2 which is not a feature all H410 boards have with this strange little cheap contraption to support the drive for SATA ports which is the chipset limit one PCI Express by 16 and 2 by 1 ports some audio it is ALC887 if I'm not mistaken it has some shielding given so maybe the sound is not that bad an 8 pin 12 volt EPS connector one hmm, one system fan and one CPU fan header and interesting and interestingly we have the also important RGB connector it is the traditional four pin one so it is not addressable but it's still something also USB 3.2 for the front of the case on the IO part we have PS2 port for I don't know it's probably USB 2.0 ports two USB 3 something on HDMI and a VGA for video output LAN and audio so that's it cheap little motherboard with very 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 basic VRM configuration which though it says it supports up to Core i9 I frankly am in a little doubt that it can actually support it without massive throttling but for a cheap system with Pentium or Core i3 it should be okay that's it for now Bye!